Now here's an entertaining video talking about the 2017 eclipse. This is in Oregon, like 20 or 30 minutes before the beginning of the eclipse. But what's so entertaining about the video is the moon is nowhere to be found in the sky. <laughs> That's because the moon is not what causes the sun to go dark in the first place. When you start studying up on ancient mythology, they believed in two suns. They believed in a black sun that would come around every so often. This omen, this bad news sign, you know, this, this solar eclipse is... And if you come over to Google, just type in sea stars through the moon. Because there's been many people that have video evidence and photographs where the moon, which is like a translucent holographic self-projecting light that apparently phases in and out because as you can see this is the moon phasing out and you can see stars right through the moon so the moon is like a holographic thing whatever the black object is that covers the sun it is not the moon like always everything we've been taught is a lie a distortion of truth I do encourage you come over Google type in ancient times black sun solar eclipse check out some of these old stories these ancient legends about the black sun because whatever it is that covers and hides the sun it is obviously not the moon it is very fascinating to see the eclipse I would love to know what this black sun is this black object that covers the sun whatever it is we're not going to know it in this lifetime when all truth is revealed we will know it but it's a it's a tragedy that in a lot of places in America they're not going to see any eclipse because the chemtrails are just too smoggy and stagnant to, to even see the sun so I guess we'll just have to watch a video on YouTube and hope it's not manipulated by you know Fox News and ABC and NBC and whoever else so.